Is that a walking bus? Oh my goodness. Whoa, whoa, he's got a machine gun. Oh my, I have a bike. I have an actual bike. What? No, no, this has been a terrible idea. Oh. Warning, the following program contains scenes of graphic stupidity between a man and some games. Don't take anything under say too serious, I'm just messing around. This video should not be viewed by anyone. How's it going everybody? Today we are taking a look at Once Human, a multiplayer open world survival game set in a strange post-apocalyptic future. Now the game is not yet fully released, it's planned to release next month, but it is part of the Steam Next Fest event so we can try it out early. And we are going to pick up today, as I was exploring the video game, I was running around and I was kinda trying to figure things out. What the, this guy's got a car? There's cars as well? Very cool. Can I yoink it? Oh, he's leaving. <laughs> Dude, I didn't know that there were cars. That's good because look at this. This is the world map. It is, I mean, it's legit huge. The map is really big by the looks of it and there are quite a few points of interest around the world that we can explore. There are also traders and quests and we have a lot of unique enemies that we can go up against as well. Oh, this shot, it doesn't do a lot of damage. Luckily, these guys don't seem to be all that powerful. Whoa, look at that. Can I take these? Shotgun shells. And beer. <laughs> Hold on, I think my crossbow may, may be a bit better than my shotty. Let's see here. Check it out. One tapped. <laughs> right. And I can recover my arrows as well. Oh, check it out. Check it out. We're inside. Oh, this is so creepy. Let me see. Maybe for a bit closer. There we go. Much better. Ooh. Scrap metal. Ooh, 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 ooh. We have some big loot over there. What is this guy doing? Look at this. <laughs> He's got a flashlight for a head. And we also have our melee weapon here, so we can do this. Can I shoot a flashlight head? There we go. Well, creeper. Gear crate. Oh, hello. A mask, gear mod, and a bunch of other things. Can I equip the mask? Uh, hold on. Oh, God. Hey, buddy. Whoa! Got him. Right, let me back up here. And let's go into our inventory. This is my character. This is my gear. If we go over here. We have a hat. We have a mask. Gloves. Shoes. Pants. A vest. And then these are our weapons. Then we can switch in between them. Let me see. Let me see. What is the mask right here? From this one we can switch to this one. Ooh, very nice. There's so many zombies here. They seem to be fairly docile though, they're not really... Jumping me! Oh my god. As I was saying. They're not really jumping me. <laughs> what the hell is this? The shit. It's got a crap out of me. What does this do? Wait, what did I just do? I can use this? Hold on, let's see if he does anything against the zombies. There's one zombie in the back here. Hey buddy, I have a flashlight. Ooh! Oh my goodness! This is an actual weapon! Does it attract everybody or what's... This thing is strong. I'm keeping it. Ooh. Oh no, it's gone. Oh. Alright, it's got uh, limited uses. Whoa, check this out. Weapons crate. Whoa, look at that. We got a sniper rifle. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing, buddy? Wait, did that say blueprint? 
Ooh. Fragment? Wait, no. Hold on a second. Let's see here. Gear. So we got a rifle and we got a vest. But it said fragments. I don't think they were actually... Oh no, they were, they were, they were. Alright, we can use that. What's happening? Guys? No, no, let me see here. So we got a new vest. We didn't get a vest, actually. Nope, the vest was a fragment, but... The sniper rifle we can actually use. I don't think I have any bullets for it, though. Oh, no, I have uh, I have a couple of bullets. Let's see here. Can we now zoom in? How do I ADS? Oh, here we go, here we go. Still not as good as my crossbow. <laughs> Damn, this thing sounds beefy. There we go. Now, there are, of course, a lot of things to do and discover in the game. And we actually have these tasks or quests that kind of guide us throughout the game. So I kind of started following them. And after completing a few tasks, I received this thing. Oh my god. We're getting a bike. What? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This looks like it'll be fun to ride. Oh my goodness. How do I put it down? Oh, 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 there we go. Oh my god, I have a bike. I have an actual bike. What? Where do we have to go? We have to go all the way up here. Look at this. <laughs> we don't actually have to walk everywhere. We have a vehicle. Oh my goodness. Now we're talking. Heck yeah. This is awesome. The fact that we get a vehicle early on and we don't have to walk everywhere is just great. And seeing that I got a vehicle from a quest, I decided to complete some more quests and see if I could get some better, some better rewards. And as I was doing that, I encountered this thing. Oh, oh my god. It's a boss! Whoa! Whoa! He's got a machine gun! What kind of boss? A double ganger? What the heck is this creature? It's made out of goo! Luckily, my crossbow is extremely overpowered. <laughs> there we go. Any loot? Wait. No loot? Now, you know when I said that I was gonna try and complete some more quests to see if I could get some better rewards? Well, I was gonna do that, but then I got distracted by this monstrosity. Oh my goodness, what is that? Is that a walking bus? Oh my god. It's it, it's it's a bus with legs. I shit you not, it's a bus with legs. Can I take it out? Or it's not a bus with legs, it's a bus with arms! I don't think he's friendly, right? Oh my goodness! Oh, it's bringing things, it's bringing things out of the ground! Luckily, they're not that strong, but there's quite a few of them. What the uh, what? The... How do I take this thing out?
I feel like we might get some sweet rewards if we manage to take it out. Can we take it out? I don't see any HP. I don't see any HP on it, so I don't think... I don't think we can take this guy out. This video game has some of the most interesting enemies that I've ever seen in a survival game. I kid you not, I kept on getting distracted by all the different monsters and whatnot. Of course, I've barely scratched the surface of the game. There's base building and bosses and a lot of different skills and things like that. So there's a lot to do and discover in this here video game. But there we have it. That's about it for today. Let me know down below if you guys want to see more of the game. And thank you so much for taking the time and hanging out with me today. I hope you have enjoyed. In case you did, be sure to drop some stuff and things down below. Make sure to subscribe and I will see you in the next one with some more video games.